Hey everybody. That little black and white wiggly thing you see there is the tail of my black ghost knife fish. And I'm really hoping he comes out and makes a little bit of an appearance for us. But now you see I really do have one. I call that this tank that name for a reason. I'm actually in the middle of doing a water change on my native tank at the moment. So we don't have very long because the tank is going to be full. I also wanted to point out while I was standing here, uh, for my regular viewers, for those of you that follow along, you'll know that I recently did some work in this tank. I removed the uh, blue-green uh, cyanobacteria with the Ultralife blue-green slime algae stain remover. And I've already noticed there is still some growing. I don't want to point the camera at it because I know the moment I move the camera, he's going to come out. But suffice it to say that I have seen um, where I had my really bad problem areas up in the top of the tank. I've got some java fern that's attached to some wood. And it was growing really, really dense and, you know, in thick mats on that stuff. And I cleaned it out as best I could before I did the treatment. Obviously, you want to remove as much as you can physically before you start treating it. And it unfortunately did not get it all. I don't think he's really going to come out and make an appearance. If you look right on the tip of some of those, uh, the Java, you can see that sort of green fuzziness off to the right hand side. Some of those little uh, fuzzy tips on the end there is actually some of that green slime cyanobacteria. So I did not wipe it out or knock it out completely when I did my treatment. So I'm going to order some more and hit it again while it's down to a bare minimum like that. I don't see any point in letting it grow in and get thick again. The tank is finally looking really good. So stay tuned for that. I will be doing a video on that real soon. And just as a little treat, here is my native tank. Almost full, so I do have to go. But you can see where I lowered the water level to, where the bubble line is, because I sprayed everything down with hydrogen peroxide. So it was a big water change, so look forward to that video too. So make sure you're subscribed, you don't want to miss anything. Don't forget, this is my Black Ghost Knife Fish Tank. Thanks for watching this one, I hope to see you real soon in the next one.